this is Amanda Wilkinson of Amanda Wilkinson Tarot. It is Wednesday, December the 15th, 2021. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Glad to have you. If you are a long-term subscriber, I thank you for your continued support. If you have not already done so, could you please like, share, and subscribe? Thank you. How are you doing today, everybody? I hope you're doing well. I hope you're taking care of yourself and the people around you and vice versa. I hope you know you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, and you have that beautiful star shining bright inside of you. This is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone out there. Take what does and leave the rest. And there's no gender in tarot. Do I have a pen? I forgot to get a paper to write the, the times on the... All right. Hello Libra, this is How Do They Feel About You? I am cutting the deck for Libra. Spirit. Four of Cups. Four of Cups. They think you're broken hearted. They think you're indifferent, you're apathetic. The sun, how do they think the sun rises it or rises and sets on you? Knight of Swords. They really want to talk to you. They really want to talk to you. The Hierophant, they want commitment. They do. Nine of the yet. Yeah. They're up at night. They're having sleepless nights. They're having dreams. They're thinking about what they what um, they could do or what they should do. But they think you're a catch. They think you're a catch. They want you. They think that you're indifferent. But the sun rises. It sets over you. They want to talk to you, they want commitment, they're up late at night wondering if you care about them, and they think you are a catch, they really think you're great. Oracle card, higher power, and bottom of the deck, breathe. It looks like they are... Kind of uh, asking their higher, higher power to, uh, they're manifesting you and they're trying to take a little break and give you time. Money cards, nine of pentacles, you are in, uh, financially independent, Libra. The High Priestess, you are, you, you are working in some kind of job that you are really, really interested in. Um, you may be an empath, um, and you like, you may have a job where you're helping people. Knight of Pentacles. You're doing well in the financial department. Business person, ground and balance stable. Just throwing my cards together. Scorpio this is the your how do they feel about you read cutting the deck for Scorpio spirit 
King of Swords. Um, I think that they, um, they want to talk to you and they think that you might be indifferent to them. Ten of Wands. Um, this is burdensome to them because they think you've got their guard up, your guard up, and uh, they want to, um, they want to have a passionate, they want this burden, they want this burdensome cycle to be over so they can have a passionate new beginning with you. The justice, the justice, um... Oh, they think that you're going to drop their drop the sword on them. We got the King of Swords who can be indifferent and we've got the Justice. They might you might they might think that you're going to drop the sword on them, that you are not interested. They're going to turn you away. The Star, they think you are the Star. They think you are their wish come true. The Moon. Oh. They think that maybe there is some deception here. That maybe you are wearing a false mask. This does not mean that you do. I'm just saying how they feel. Queen of Swords. Um, they think that you're their soulmate. We got the King and Queen of Swords. But they think they think that you are indifferent. Um, you may think they're stubborn, indifferent. They think that you're stubborn and different. They think that this is a burden, but they want a passionate new beginning. They think you're going to drop the sword on them. You are their wish come true. They think there are secrets, deceptions here. And they think you are their soulmate with the king and queen of swords, but they think you're indifferent. I got a lot of indifference, different cards. Oracle, milk and honey, they want everything with you, poised, they're willing to um, work together with you on this, money, page of swords, ah, someone may be watching at work, and this might, this is not in a good way, this is my stalker card, so, um, I don't know if someone is too much into your business. The chariot. But you are moving forward. You are moving forward. Um, you might have a different, uh, you might be getting a different job offer. You may be moving forward into another, another better job. Especially if you want to get rid of this stalker energy five of swords yes there is some uh, toxic behavior here in your workplace someone is stalking you or watching you too closely you are going to have the opportunity to find a new job and it looks like your workplace may be toxic Hello Sagittarius, how do they feel about you? How do they feel about you? I am cutting the deck for Sagittarius. Spirit. The Hierophant. They want commitment with you. They see engagement, they see marriage. The magician, they are manifesting you into their life. They want a relationship. 
Page of Swords. Um, they may be stalking you. They may be stalking you. Kind of don't like that energy very much. Um, let's see. Five of Cups. Uh, they think you're a. Uh, um, they think you are broken hearted, but they want to offer you, um, these two cups. They want soulmate. They think you're their soulmate and they're really hurt that it seems like you are heartbroken. Knight of Wands. Ooh, they're very passionate about you. Very passionate about you. Um, there's a little bit of player energy here. Um, I don't know. Maybe they think that you're a player, male or female. This is not necessarily what you're like, but that's how they see you. They're stuck between, they're caught between a rock and a hard place. They don't know what to do. They want commitment with you. They're manifesting you into their life. I think they're watching you, um, a little bit. Um, this is kind of stalkery. They think you're done with them, but they do want you. They may think you're a player, and they're caught between a rock and hard place because they don't know where to go from here. Oracle, a leg up. They're looking for, they're looking for help. Um, they're trying to get on your good side, I think. They may be. They may be asking friends about you. Serendipity. Looking for something. Finding something when you're, oh. Kind of like divine timing or finding something when you aren't looking for it money queen of wands queen of wands um whatever your work is you're very admired you're very passionate about your work seven of sword um i would keep my eye out because someone may be sneaky um at your work um someone may be uh Sneaky, there's lying, there may be lying, cheating, stealing, toxic, toxic, looks like a toxic workplace. Oh, maybe you need a new, maybe you are, maybe you are done with this job and you want something new. My goodness, I'm feeling a bit tired. Capricorn, 1403. Hello there, Capricorn. This is your, how do they feel about you reading? I am cutting the deck for Capricorn. Spirit. The magician, they are manifesting you into their life. They um they love you, they're passionate about you. They want you. Oh, they think that you think this is done. They think you think this is over. The fool, they want to take a leap of faith. They really do. They, uh, they want to, they want a relationship with you. 
Oops. Seven of Pentacles, they're willing to work on this with you. And this clipped out. They may think you have player tendencies, whether you do or not. I'm not saying, but they think. They think that you may be a player. Nine of Wands, they think you have your guard up. The Magician, they are trying to manifest you into your life. They want you. They think that you think it's over. They want to take a leap of faith with you. They want to work on this. They think you may be a player. And they think that you've got your guard up when it comes to them. Higher power. Looks like they are... Um, um, let's just say trying to manifest you into their life. And uh, they are thinking, taking some time to themselves to rest, relax, recuperate. I think because they think that you have your guard up. Money cards. The temperance. Divine timing. Are you waiting to find out something about your job. You may be looking for another job um, and trusting Source Spirit Universe will give you what you need at the proper time. Knight of Swords. Um, I think that you need to communicate with the people that you work with a little bit more. This talks about communication. Maybe there's um, some um, some honest, clear communication that needs to be done. And the moon. Um, are there secrets? Secrets, masks being worn in your job situation. Someone might not be just as honest or trustworthy as they try to Make it seem. Aquarius, Aquarius, how do they feel about you? How do they feel about you? Cutting the deck for Aquarius. Spirit. Page of Swords, I think they're stalking you. This is my stalker card. The moon, they think you're keeping secrets from them. That's probably why they're stalking you. The justice, they think that you're going to drop the sword on this. You're not going to entertain their, what they want from you. Um, but with the stalker energy and the secrets and deceptions, I would not blame you if you cut them out of your life. Yeah, they see you as closed off. Um, there's the sword again. You know us. We're all about honest, clear communication. Um, they think that you are are cold and distance, distant. Sorry, distant. Five of Pentacles. Um, um, if they talk to you, um, they are gonna like throw a pity por party oh poor me um like drama 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 oh um i'm feeling so alone you know stuff like that i don't trust this person i don't i don't trust this person with this energy at all they are passionate about you 
they are stalking you they think that they think that you are keeping secrets from them they think that you're gonna drop the sword on them and they think you're cold and indifferent they're gonna try and make you feel sorry for them to get back in your life they are passionate about you they are but i wouldn't trust this person i wouldn't trust this person at all oracle cards thinker i would think seriously about this round and round i feel like um this is a karmic cycle going around with with the rest of these cards here i think this is a karmic cycle and i think you need to drop your sword aquarius this is i call this the aquarius card i think you need to drop your sword on them money page of wands you're passionate about what you do wheel of fortune wheel spinning in upward direction for you this is success you are having success in your work life eight of cups um are you thinking about maybe moving to a new position or maybe with the page of wands and the wheel and fortune that you are going to get a raise or promotion and uh something with better money i like the passionate and the wheel of fortune right there for you my 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 getting a little tired here Hello Pisces. How do they feel about you? I had my three of wands flip out. How do they feel about you, Pisces? No, oh, cutting the deck for Pisces. I almost forgot to cut the deck. Spirit. I wonder if I cut the deck for Aquarius. Three of Wands. It came out. They are waiting for you. They are waiting for you. Four of Cups. They think you're indifferent. They think you're uh, um, apathetic. They want to give you their cup, but they think that you're indifferent. High Priestess. High Priestess um they think you are divine feminine um they want you in their life and they think that you have you have got them figured out knight of cups see they want to give their cup to you they love you they do ace of wands Ooh, they are passionate about you they want to give you their wand male or female nine of pentacles oh they think that you're successful and independent um and they think that you are single and you want to stay single they are waiting for you they want to give you their cup they think you're uh indifferent they think maybe that you've got them all figured out but they think that you are divine divine feminine they want to give you their cup they want to give you their wand male or female they think that you are uh too independent and that you are not interested in a relationship whether you do or not 
I'm just saying how they feel. Oracle card. Mending. Healing. Are you healing from something? Maybe they're healing for something. Round and round and round. Um... This may have been going in circles for a while. Money. Seven of Pentacles, the money tree. You have money. You are working on your money and you're watching it grow. Page of Wands, you're passionate about what you're doing. Your job. Passionate about your job. And... Eight of Wands. You might have to travel for work. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Have a great evening. Uh, this has been Amanda Wilson of Amanda Wilson Tarot. Bye for now.